It's weighing day. You're on the way to the scale, and you already know you're not on weight. So what I came to do today, so you won't have this situation, is to give you just a few tips on how to manage, how to stay away from that penalty that you're gonna get for not being on weight once you become a pro, and how to manage the swelling in the body so you won't walk around puffy. So the first thing we're gonna do, I like to introduce myself for those who have never watched me before. Shame on you. My name is Eric A. Bradley, AKA the CEO of Master Boxing, AKA the Real Fight Doctor. And there is no other on this level. So what I wanna do is make sure that you understand this first and foremost. There are several variances in meal planning and eating food. The first things is the rules of law. First rule of law is you do not wake up first thing in the morning and start shoveling food into your mouth. Why? First thing is because the body's already been working all night. If you open your mouth like this, ah, and your tongue is loaded and coated with white, that's all the toxins from all the digestion that you've been going through already the entire night. The first thing you need to do is get up and ingest some water. That's the first thing you need to do. Allow that body to satiate with that water, finish off its process. The first thing I like to do is I like to add lime to mine. And what does this do? Well, it gives the body a great balance and alkalinity. Why does this matter to me? Alkalinity prevents the body from swelling. An acidic body allows the body to swell, feel puffy, hands, face. You felt it before. You've done all the things right in your diet and you still was swollen. That's acidity. Your body's inflamed and you can't lose weight when your body's inflamed. It holds on to that fluid and you want to fix that. So whether it's a lemon or a lime, make sure that's one of the first things you do. Put that water, heat it up, man. Next thing you wanna do is allow the body to finish off the process, getting that stuff out of your body, that waste. So I, late morning to noon, I have my first meal. And the first things that I put into my body and the first things that you should put into your body we go against all laws of God all the time, but you gotta get back to it. Blueberries, high in antioxidants, meant for the body, helps digestion. Pomegranate seeds, very good and high in potassium. Also creates balance within the blood flow. And digestion is important. Strawberries, I love myself some strawberries. When I was growing up, I used to have my strawberries and they were called frankenberries and they weren't that healthy for you but hey what's a man to do you got to get your frankenberry on um these are the first tips that will help you get you past that first point next thing you need to know as we got we have a list right here and eating that mid morning that late morning early afternoon you'll start to notice your body feeling really light you feel a little more active, you feel a little more capable. You might deal with a little hunger at first. Don't worry about that. Your body's allowing itself to run the course of digestion the right way. Once you start to put food in it, these type foods make the digestive process happen. So once you eat after that, boom, another two and a half hours later, boom, according to your DNA, whatever your DNA is, your metabolic rate is high, then hey, do what you need to do. Now you've already gotten this thing on lock. Now what's next to do? Now, to prevent you from just overconsumption, understand your portions. And if you don't understand your portions, my friend, learn them. Uh, scientists like myself, the people that are in my circle, and you know if you're in my circle, you lose 15 pounds just by knowing my name because I'm about that life. The first thing we're gonna do for you rascals is give you that detox plan. And it's not some little drink. This is meals. These are the kind of meals and foods that'll help cleanse your freaking body. 
Yes, I said it. You have to be shame on yourself. But I came to rescue you. So, like I said, follow these steps, man, for 18 days. And you tell me what you're feeling. I don't have to tell you what you're going to experience. You come back and holler at me. Um, that's all I got. Make sure that you use this advice. Don't holler at me talking about, hey, coach, I don't try this, I don't try that. No, do this. I'm versed in this sport. I'm versed in this game. This is what I do. Get your meals on lock if you don't have it. Get your detox on lock for free today if you don't have one in place. That's the first step. Water, berries, cleansing. Wait until late morning, early afternoon to eat first meal. Allow their body to get prepped. And remember this, you eat late in the morning and you don't eat after six o'clock p.m. Allow your body to start to just permeate with the results. That's what's gonna happen, I'm telling you. Do this, the first 18 days you'll see what it is. That's all I got for you today. Reach out if you need to ask more questions. You can find us at masterboxingllc.com. You can follow us at Master Boxing across the social media board. My name is Coach Bradley. I thank you guys for watching. CEO of Master Boxing, I'm out. Peace. Clean nutrition for athletes. Get in the game, man. You better make weight. Don't look at me all sideways. Y'all see what time it is. Peace.